So guys, what is going on? My name is Amstar, and today we're going to take a little bit in-depth look of SimCity, the new SimCity. Yes, I said the new SimCity. If you don't, do not know what the new SimCity is, I'm going to say SimCity one more time. Are you ready? Do you got my attention? Let's go. SimCity is a well simulated game of real life and well what this actually means is you can have industries such as manufacturing tourism and education and a lot of others each of these have a distinct appearance and simulate behavior and economic strategies when i say economic strategies i am talking about supply and demand let's go with it so what i'm actually talking about this is if you have uh ecom you pretty much learn how supply and demand works right so when i when i say this is that you have a lot of industries, and you got to see how they react to each other. If you have a lot of tourism, you're gonna have a, you're gonna want a lot of places that they can buy stuff. So then you have a casino. Well, what does the casino do? It causes a lot of money, but also what does the con do of that? Is a lot of crime rates. So in in Sin, Sin City, wow, I said Sin City. In Sim City, simulates real life. So what I'm talking about real life is, example here, you have a well ripple effect. What does a ripple effect do? Cause and effect. If you don't, if you do not take care of the small things, it's going to produce a lot bigger problems. For example, I'm going to say this very quick. So uh, listen up. You have a casino. Well, casinos are get paid or get laid or go broke, go home broke. <laughs> no, seriously, guys. But seriously, if you have a casino and you have a lot of money and people want to st steal from you. You're going to have a lot of crime rate, and that crime rate is going to go in different cities in your one region. So you got to take care of those with military force. And how do you do that? Not military force, but police force. Wow, military. We're not in the war. Come on. Military force. So you want to set up a lot of police shops, or not police shops, well, police, you know, police buildings, departments, and whatnot. And you got to take care of that crime, or else that crime is going to spread, and your city is going to go to shit. Simple as that. Seriously, it really is. So you have to have a manager thought. You have, this game is played for strategies. Well, you can you can play to have fun, you know, build a city, a lot of bunch of UFOs and tornadoes and earthquakes happen, and just watch your uh, town turn to shit. But that'd be the fiend point. But once you build, what goes up must come down eventually, right? So there you go. Have fun with it. So you can have full control of your city or region. When I say that, you before in other games you couldn't really have a curvy road. But in this one, you can. And the uh, new thing about SimCity is multiplayer. Yes, we, well, I, not we, but the developers with SimCity, they finally produced something with multiplayer. So you can have one guy specialize. Okay, for example, uh, scenario, I can specialize in casinos. My friend can uh, specialize in uh manufacturer and someone can produce or specialize in education education produces a lot of technology that technology produces tourism because it makes cool stuff and voila we have a lot of people flowing into our cities we're making money we're doing everything great but also you got to take care of the little things remember you have to take care of the little things if you have a water damage clear it up or else you're going to have people going home six through six sick <laughs> You're going to have a lot of people sick through your water, and it's going to cause uh, cause your whole cities to uh, go wiped out. It's going to be it's going to be hell. Now, I feel like for me, when I'm saying, giving this in, in depth, I should give a little bit specs about the game. Well, Glass Box, if you do not know, that's the game engine is uh, Glass Box. You can Google that and all that, and it will tell you all the technology and how it's run. Anyways, but what uh, the glass box is, it's a wholly new engine that this game is based on, and it's just amazing. Uh, I cannot explain it in one video. You have to go on YouTube, and they will explain it. Developers that actually built it will just uh, pretty much give you notes and uh, facts about what this actually glass box is. And pretty much it tells you, it simulates as best as you can on the web, and in any game engine, it's the best. So just go Google it. I thought I'd throw that little note in there. Let's continue. Also, they involved that you could save through the cloud. So no matter where you're going to play it, no matter what computer you're going to play it, as long as it actually has a game, that you can actually play with wherever you want to play, considering, like I said, if you have the game. All you got to do, save to the cloud, load your save from the cloud, good to go. So the last few notes before I wrap this thing up, I just want to talk about a little bit more multiplayer because 
they're actually implementing multiplayer for the first time in SimCity. And to be honest, SimCity is going to be really awesome with a new multiplayer system because that you own, or for example, like I said before, I own my casino operating system and I might have some crime, but I got to manage that. And then just so they don't go in my other friends or my other players' cities so they don't get screwed or uh, any bad crimes happen there and there's going to be more just utter disaster and you don't want that so what i gotta do is manage my city so it, so he has to manage his city but the thing about me is if i have my casinos my banks my businesses i have to have power how do i get that i ask my friend to carry out the power supplies specialize in power i buy from them he sends it over or or vice versa i have my tourists go to him he has some businesses he controls the housing area i can i can uh specialize in all the business area things can be run like that in the in the possibilities are just utterly endless and and uh just to sum up everything uh my my channel is mainly focused around gaming and everything call of duty borderlands fallout all that crazy cool stuff but i want to implement my channel into something new something more and i think i'm going to start doing a lot of uh Sim City, and when it comes out, I'm going to be doing a lot of multiplayer with my with my uncle and some other friends, and maybe do a live commentary. So if you like this video, please leave a like. Follow me on Twitter at Amstar underscore. Outro will uh, lead you to that as well. And um, guys, I hope you really enjoyed this video. Please leave a comment what you think. Are you getting ready for uh, Sim City? What do you think it's going to be? It's going to be one of the biggest titles of 2013. I'm so excited. Make sure make sure you hit that subscribe button for more information. Follow me on Twitter at Amsar underscore. And I am out of here and have a good day. Oh, by the way, a little FYI gameplay is not is not me. I do not own that. The audio I do own. That's me. That's my talking. The uh, gameplay links are all in the description. They're pretty much developers that uploaded it in all those trailers. So with all that in mind, links are all in the description. Click like, thumbs up, share this video, subscribe. Outro.